A tragic accident. That's how sources describe the chain of events that killed the art teacher driving this car on I-93. Five investigates learning video from highway cameras shows an SUV changing lanes. Not much more can be seen, but they believe the vehicle passed over the manhole cover, dislodging it, sending it through the air and into the windshield of the Honda. The big issue, I think, for everybody is, uh, is that our, our hearts and, and our thoughts go out to a family that, through an incredibly bizarre event, uh, lost, lost someone today. The state taking quick action, sending crews to inspect 500 manhole covers, grates, and panels on highways in Boston. We watched from the MassDOT Highway Command Center as the work got underway, making sure all of the hardware was secure. So far, no major issues reported from the inspections. The state says it checks manholes on highways every two years. Do you think that there should be more inspections, or are you going to look into whether more should be done? Well, I think the standard procedure is they need to be inspected once every two years, within a two-year period. And this one had been inspected, I think, in June of 2014. The Massachusetts inspection schedule in line with a federal recommendation issued last year. Sources tell Five Investigates they found no problems like cracking or evidence of freezing on the manhole and cover in the I-93 crash. The only only other identical incident they've uncovered, this one in June 2014 in New York State. A truck driver from Springfield, Massachusetts was killed as he drove on the Cross Bronx Expressway. A truck in front of him kicked up a manhole cover, sending it through his windshield. And in that case in New York, they were never able to determine exactly why that manhole cover came loose when the truck went over it. Now, investigators here are still at work hoping they can find answers. Karen Anderson, Five Investigates. Nearly